and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello. My name is Katie, I live in Orlando, and I make all Shop With Me videos. My favorite stores are Target, Home Goods, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, did I already say TJ Maxx? <laughs> I don't even know. Walmart, I just love shopping, showing you what's new in the stores, sharing my hauls with you. So if you love shopping, home decor, hauls, videos like that, you're definitely gonna love it here. So please take a second to give this video a big thumbs up right down below. And if you haven't yet and you feel so inclined, please make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Today's video is going to be a TJ Maxx shop with me. I don't shop very often at standalone TJ Maxx stores. We don't really have that many where I live. We honestly have more like standalone Marshalls and Tons of like home goods Marshall combo stores, but we don't have a lot of TJ Maxx stores around us. So I like to make the trip out every once in a while to do like standalone TJ Maxx shop with me videos. It's always so fun to see what's new in the store, what they have, so that I can show you what you might be able to find this week at a store near you. I know that it is only like June, July ish time, but I am telling you we're gonna start seeing fall decor really soon. So I'm super interested to see what they have for like late summer, maybe even what's in the clearance section, furniture wise. I'm just super excited to get in there I also kind of want to check out the jewelry I'm looking for a pair of coral earrings for a little like family photo shoot we have coming up um, in a couple weeks but I want to go ahead and get inside let's go see what is new at TJ Maxx this week this is really pretty like this little two-tiered tray it's like kind of looks like wood but also it's like a gold metal but it's like a brush type gold if you can see i don't know why my camera's having a really hard time focusing on it obviously the background is very busy but this is really really pretty and this is only 16.99 i love this item this would be perfect for a pantry they have it in potatoes as well as onions so this is really cute if you have like a big family and you keep a lot of those items on hand the potatoes one does have this like rope woven like little accents but the onions one has like wood on the handles so I do kind of wish they were the same so it's a little bit weird that they're different because they're like the same item but just like onions and potatoes but if you have a big family and you keep a lot of this stuff on hand these are really cute for like a pantry or organization growing up we had five kids in my family so we had always a ton of potatoes we ate so many baked potatoes we always had lots of onions so these would have been like really handy for our big family these gold trays are literally beautiful they have a couple different sizes. They're a good weight, like a really pretty galvanized gold. I love the scalloped detail on the edges. It does say it is handcrafted in India. And this smaller size is $16.99. There is a bigger one as well. So let me dig this one out so I can tell you the price. Well, as I'm going to move that, I wanted to show you these little like fruit baskets. These are really pretty. They're matte black with gold accents, which if you have that in your kitchen, I feel like this is not like an easy combo to come by. So these are super, super, pretty little fruit baskets but like i was gonna say to you the small one is $16.99 and the bigger one is $24.99 these would be a perfect layering piece on like your island or maybe a coffee table dining table if you just want to add some metallic flair so those potato and onion buckets i was just showing you they actually have them in this like brushed bronze color as well so definitely look out for these at your store i'm very sorry if there's like a lot of background noise or like you know distracting noise in the back i feel like this is like the loudest busiest store in america right now a lot of like employees buzzing around which is great we love to see it but makes it a little bit hard to film i love how this store has all like their wood items put together this bowl that has like lemons on the inside with the little like lemon salad fork and spoon is so so cute would be perfect for like fruit salad or regular salad it's really pretty on the inside and the outside this set is perfect for the summer and it is $24.99 this little like cheese board knife set it looks like a seashell the little like cheese board underneath it and then it comes with three little tools that also have little seashells on them this would make such a cute little housewarming gift for $16.99 this tiered tray is really really cool as well I love the black on the bottom would be perfect for just like a little kitchen island if you wanted to do like a candle some coats Posters, salt and pepper set something like that you can change it out with seasonal decor definitely a lot of options is this like a shot glass carrying case it comes with four little like copper shot glasses and this cute tiny carrying case is that what this is because that's kind of funny and it is $12.99 I love this little pedestal bowl with like these turquoise beads. Really, really pretty like handcrafted in India item. This is $16.99. The little teal color is very, very pretty, especially if you do like coastal decor, it would be stunning. They have these really, really pretty trays, hand carved wood tray. This one's like carved on the inside, but then this one's like plain on the inside, but carved on the outside. 
so so pretty definitely a little bit of digging involved in this section but you can find some really good hidden gems okay i'm showing you these because i'm just absolutely obsessed with mine but right now they have a bunch of lazy susan cheese boards or whatever type of boards you want to use it for even for like a little centerpiece on a table you can easily pass stuff to other people if you're having like a big dinner but we love ours so i wanted to show you that they have a lot of different like color variations and options and sizes here we're just obsessed i feel like it's something everyone should have and it makes a really good gift as well so i wanted to show these to you another really cool thing i do like to shop here for which people might think this is pretty cringy but i like to look at like their food i mainly like to look at like the spices the olive oils as well as the coffees honestly these are such a good deal compared to the grocery store they have a lot of different like types but they do sell the starbucks coffee here this bag would be like 12 dollars in the grocery store and here it's only 5.59 definitely check the dates on stuff but you can find really cool stuff like this in these stores so this is best before july 15th 2021 which is about a few few weeks from now but I think that we could drink it in time this one is best before July 21st so you have a, over a month to drink it if you have a coffee lover in your life this is definitely a good place to check okay since it's right next to it and I love these I wanted to show you these gummy bears the Albanese sour gummy bears they say start sour stay sour and they really mean it they are the most my mouth is literally watering they are the most sour sour bears that you can find so if you have someone in your life that likes sour stuff, or if you like sour items, I would definitely buy these here. This is one of my favorite candies. I have been seeing a surge in appliances lately. They have a lot of appliances. This is actually the brand of air fryer that I have. This is like a skinny air fryer. It's like a slimline one. I'm sure it works just as good as the one I have. Honestly, I need a new one, and this is kind of intriguing, but definitely check your stores because you can save some money on these like name brand things that you can also find at Target for like a lot more money, which is definitely the point of these stores, but I've definitely been seeing a surge in appliances at like all the Home Goods, TJ Maxx, and Marshalls stores. So if you're in the market for something specific, definitely check here. Here's an Emerald Air Fryer. It is $70 for seven quarts. I always recommend get at least minimum five quarts. We have a seven quart air fryer and I wish we had like a 20 quart air fryer, honestly. We could cook so much more food at once. We typically have to cook things in shifts, but that's a really good deal for a name brand air fryer. This is also catchy my attention this oxo cold brew carafe i'm wondering if it just keeps cold brew or if it also makes cold brew because that's really cool and this is only 12.99 and this is something we could definitely get use out of i don't think it actually like brews the coffee i feel like it just like keeps cold brew i don't know maybe i need to like google it here is a bottle sterilizer i know these are very popular for people that have babies i've never heard of this brand but i don't have kids so i'm not necessarily like the best person to know about all baby stuff but this is cool if you're looking for like a gift for somebody who's having a baby just check the appliance section okay there's a wide variety of appliances here oh cute these look just like the ones that megan used in the collab i just did with her for my master bathroom like transformation this does come in a set of three but it looks like one is missing but these look extremely similar this is also a much better deal it's 12.99 for all three if they were all in there but i will say the ones that we got at home goods were a lot bigger but definitely if you were interested in those you can still find them in store these are super pretty and would definitely help transform your space organization and aesthetically oh no did a little kid lose its toy this definitely looks like a little kid lost their toy and it's the pig from Toy Story oh no I hope you find your home alrighty so that was what was kind of new over in the home decor section some really really cool finds but now I want to check out the jewelry like I said I need to find some coral earrings I found a pair online but they are pretty pricey plus when you add shipping although I'm sure I could find other things on the website to buy that would make the shipping free is anyone else like that where you're like I don't want to pay for shipping but I'll spend $40 more on items to get free shipping why are we like this let's check out the earrings I always have some really cute ones and then I'm also gonna make sure to check the checkout aisle as well because they always had really cute jewelry in there but let's just see what they have over here in the jewelry section no no she makes necklaces now she just knows no boundaries although i will say this k necklace is awfully cute it like hangs horizontally instead of vertically which I actually really like it's sterling silver though and I need stuff that I don't have to take off so it would have to be like gold plated or whatever and these are sterling silver but I can't lie I actually kind of like it like this C is that not pretty cute I don't know like I feel like that one's cute this one does hang vertically so it's like a little bit different but 
Dang, Ray Dunn. She's not gonna stop, ever. I am not an artist in any way, shape, or form, but I think that this is seriously the cutest necklace ever. If you have someone in your life that's a painter, this would be a really, really cute gift. I just love how it comes with the little paintbrush and the little like paint palette, and it's only $14.99. There's also a lot of like anklets. I feel like they normally don't have anklets, but because it's the summer, they have like a lot right now, and these are really, really cute. I'm not like an anklet person, but if I was, I feel like these are a really good price. I just noticed in the case, they have these little blinged out pineapples. Those are really, really cute and they're only $12.99. I wish they weren't so like blingy, but I really, really love them because obviously they're pineapples. These are pretty cool. Not something we get a ton of use out of here in Florida, but maybe if you own like a restaurant or if your family has a restaurant, it'd be worth checking your stores. If you wanted to have like a four season patio or three season patio at your restaurant, I feel like you see these a lot at restaurants and they're only $149. So I feel like that'd be a really good deal for that type of person. Definitely like a really niche product and I don't really know why they sent them to the stores in Florida because it is pretty hot here like 340 days out of the year. And even the days where it's not like super hot, like our cold days, like we do have some days that are like in the 30s and 40s, you can sit outside with like a blanket and it's super nice because there's like no bugs and we cherish those days as well here in Florida. But yeah, so definitely a niche product, but still a cool find. Peeking at the like swim cover ups and this one is actually so pretty. It's an extra large, but it's more of like a, like a moo moo. I don't know. I kind of want to see if I can find it in my size because I think this would be a really pretty cover up. But honestly, it would also just be like a cute little summer dress. You could like tie it at the bottom. This has potential for sure. This one right behind it too. This is so cute. This could just be like a summer dress. This is also an extra large, but this one is also really cute. And if you wore like the right bra and underwear, this would be more of a dress than a beach cover up. They have a bunch of these Joyco products right here that actually caught my eye. Right in the front is the brightening shampoo and conditioner. And I'm running low on shampoo and conditioners and I always like to switch it up. So I might pick these up because I don't know, they're kind of calling to me. They also have like purple shampoos, um, blue ones. Cause like for if you have more orangey hair or whatever it is, they like balance out the color, but they just have like a bunch of different Joyco products at a super good price. Okay, I just wanted to quickly show you what I got at TJ Maxx. Nothing too exciting, but I just thought it was such a great deal. I decided to grab two bags of the Starbucks coffee. They're both in date, they're still good. They are the whole bean, and I noticed a lot of the ones that they had were whole beans, so maybe that's why, like, if they're getting close to the date, Starbucks will send them to those stores to kind of, like, liquidate them. I feel like a lot of people just buy, like, the ground coffee, but it tastes so much better when you, like, freshly grind it and then, like, use, I don't know, pour over or French press whatever way you like to enjoy your coffee. But these are such a good deal. These were $5.59. These are the normal size bags. These would be like $12 to $15 at like Target. So I just felt like it was a really, really good deal. I did get the Pike Place, which is my favorite. And then I got the Cafe Verona, which is a dark roast, which Brian loves. So I was able to pick up both of these for less than the price of what I would pay for one at like a big box store. And then the other two products I picked up, you saw right at the end, I did decide to pick up the Joyco Blonde Life products. They had the brightening conditioner and the brightening shampoo and it was like right there. Those were the only two bottles. It just like felt like they were like made for me to buy them. Um, they were $7.99 each. So a lot cheaper than you would like find them at Ulta. So I'm really excited to try these. I have not tried them, but I did make sure to search them on Google first and I saw the reviews at like Ulta and Sephora and they look really good. So I'm super excited to try this out. I have naturally blonde hair. If you didn't know, a lot of people always think that I dye my hair. I don't dye my hair I don't get highlights I have never put like I don't think I've ever put any bleach products in my hair but yeah so people are always like shocked to hear that this is my natural hair color I do have like naturally really dark roots which is funny because my sister my middle sister has really light eyebrows but really dark hair so we kind of got like swapped in that aspect luckily she's able to dye her eyebrows like to match her hair but yeah so i picked up these products i'm really excited to try them if you want to see what i think about them after a few days i always get a lot of questions on like my hair and skincare routines they're very simple definitely make sure to follow me on instagram if you are interested in seeing how i end up liking these products Alrighty, you guys, that is gonna be it from me. I really hope that you enjoyed seeing what was new this week at TJ Maxx. Definitely let me know down below what was your favorite thing I showed in today's video. If you haven't yet, please take a second to give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps my channel a lot. And if you love this video and you feel like it, go ahead and hit the subscribe button while you are down there. But that is gonna be it from me. I will see you next time. Bye, guys.